Okay, to work your way through this problem, um, you want to draw in a couple of extra lines, um, two radiuses in fact. So we're going to go from P into the centre, and then we're going to go from O to Q. Uh, we should be told, yes, that the centre is O. So that's going to be very helpful because we're going to be able to um, work out um, a number of angles which are the same. I'm going to mark them in green, all the angles that are the same, and explain why they're the same. So you can see that POT is isosceles, so you'll see the two green marks I've made, those angles will be the same. I'll come to those in a moment. And then you can see that in TOQ, um, the angles at T and Q, because it's isosceles, will be the same. Now because um, ATO, so let's write that down, ATO equals 90, because the tangent, then we know that OTP, OTP is going to equal 90, take 58, which is 32. And because it's isosceles, we'll see that um, TPO, TPO will also equal 32. So we've got two of the angles in the triangle, so if we take those two angles away from 180, we'll get 116. So POT equals 116. Now our angle POQ, POQ is going to equal TOQ and that's because the um, TQ, because TQ equals uh, QP, they're identical. So we can find our angle um, there and there. They're going to have to make 2x plus 116, it's going to equal 360. So that's going to give us an angle we need to get towards the solution. So 2x is going to equal 244. 244 and 116 make 360. So x will equal 112. Now the angles are marked in red are t and q, there's two of them. So we can see that 2x plus 112 are the angles inside the triangle. They'll make 180. And we can work out the angle required from there. So x will be a half of 180, take away 112. Um, that would be 62. I'll put 2x equals 62, uh, not 62, sorry, let's have a look at that. 112 would be 68. And so uh, x will equal 34. I'll put that up here, x equals 34. Okay. So the kind of uh, reasons we give, well, we, we knew that A to O um, was a tangent, and that's how we found um, our, one of our angles that I'll mark in here for you. Uh, we then used a mixture of isosceles triangles to get other points, and the angle around a point, um, and then the angles in a triangle make 180. Um, so that's the explanation for that fairly long, difficult circle theorems question.